Hey guys, Andrew Shrout here in the sideboard. I'm here with your Columbus Standard Open champion, Joe Lissette. Congratulations, Joe. Thank you. Happy to be here. That was, uh, today was fun. Or this weekend was fun. I had a good time. I've got a little more than a handshake for yeah. you. Yeah. All right. The, this, a standard open trophy of your very own. Uh, not your first. Of course, this is what, trophy number four on the Open Series for you? This is my fourth. This is my, so I'm now, I have four standard top eights, and I won three of them. Okay. And I have, who knows how many legacy top eights, I won one of them. Okay. So the conversion rate is maybe not quite what I would have expected, but I'll take, I'm happy. Sure, a, a standard titan. Right, exactly, that. yes. I mean, my reputation is completely, you know, Everyone has a wrong idea about me. Right. It's I'm pretending to be a legacy right. expert. All right, well, yeah. we're going to set the record straight starting now then, okay. I suppose. So uh, coming off of, of course, an appearance in the Players' Championship at right. the end of 2014, uh, you played blue, a white blue heroic there and uh, ran it right back. Yeah, yeah, I liked the deck. Um, it was, I mean, I didn't do great at the Players' Championship with mm -hmm. it, but I did OK, and it was, mm -hmm. I, I, I still like it. And uh, so the only, I, from the Players' I like, I. In the meantime, I took out the Spectre Ward, and I was like, God, this card seems a little shaky, and then I put it back in. Sure. Because <laughs> it's, 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 I only bring it in occasionally against certain, a few things, but it's pretty cool when it works. Yeah, yeah. Well, we saw some, we saw it do fantastic work that was, there in the finals. So I cast it three times in the two days, and mm -hmm. two of those times were in the finals. Okay. <laughs> All right. Um, yeah, it's, it's, it's super exciting, because it's, you know, against, you know, decks that can actually, like, a lot of times the creatures get out of burn range, mm -hmm. but they don't get out of like chain to the rocks range. And but that thing, if they don't have glare of heresy or erase, I mean it's just yeah, they're, they're, it, you can't stop it. As we saw, yeah, it, it took like a game that looked kind of bad and yeah. turned, turned it into yeah. you having a turn two or a two turn clock. Yeah, that game, oh, that game two, I I thought I was gonna win, but I mean he had a lot of things he could have drawn and he mm -hmm. hit one and that's fine. But uh, yeah, then having it actually just naturally drawing in game three, I was like, this is gonna be awesome. Not bad, yeah. not bad at all. So uh, we saw you in, in season three last year make a pretty strong push to earn your seat in the Players' Championship yeah. in 2014. You're off to a pretty good start this year. Yeah, yeah, I definitely, um, I, after the Players' Championship, mm -hmm. I, I immediately decided, okay, my, my number one magic goal for this year is to okay. go back. All right. And so I was in pretty good shape for season one okay. and then kind of less good shape for season two. So okay. I was like, okay, if I'm gonna, if I'm gonna go to some events, I'll, I'll get it out right away. So I bought tickets for the first two events mm -hmm. And then I was like, well, I'll see how that goes. And after that, maybe I'll pass on the next several. Sure. And All right. Well, OK. We, it went well. It, it went well. It, it so like yeah, went well. so you might see me in a few more of them All over right. the next month or two. Yeah. Awesome. Good news uh, you know, for myself and for, for fans of Joe Lissette and of Magic the Gathering. And Spectral Ward. And, and fans of Spectral Ward, for sure. Uh, congratulations, and uh, good luck in your future quests Thank for you. Players Championship 2015. Cedric, Patrick, back to you guys.